Ooh. All right. Um, I just want to really, really get like emphasize to you guys why you don't want to be parallel like that. Because I'm seeing you guys are getting better at it. I'm still seeing some of you guys doing that. And um, like your hips, your hips are where you want them to be. And if you're if you're if they're not in your pocket like that, landed in the hips right here where they can't move. Like I mean, if you try to get out of here, it's gonna take them a little bit. Go through, but if you're parallel with him like this, I mean, he's gonna, he can almost just fall right. So it's really important that he's in your hips right there, and you're not. You guys are making that T in your body. Like, see how right here, we're in a straight line, parallel? Here, his body and my body are making the T, and he's in that pocket. He's, he's gonna, we're gonna get some back right here if you can get in this position. So just really want to point that out, make, make that clear. Um, what else? Um, well, okay, so I'm sure a lot of you guys know arm bars pretty well. Um, I don't do arm bars that much, but for you that do, this is a great setup for your bar right here if you don't get it. See, so you, you're rolling through. See, so you do get it or you don't. You're right here. Which, either way, when he's coming off, he's coming off, you can sink your bar right here and just drive in. All of a sudden, you got your bar and, and you're ready to run it. I mean, I'm not not the best at showing the bar, but I mean, I can. So I'll give you guys, look, you look how much pressure he has with his hips. Yeah, you want. That's the biggest thing in in riding on top is your hip pressure. You don't want to be chest down, hips up. I mean, you're not gonna. He's gonna come up. He's gonna get in his base right there. You want to be hips in like that. So, um, for for running the bar, real quick. I mean, let's. I guess let's go over that a little bit right now. Um, you really. You know what, I don't, I'm not going to show the ball. Yeah, sure. You, you, you yeah, break sure. it down really well. Okay, so I do it, but I don't break it down Yeah, I mean, the biggest thing here in getting, getting the arm bar is keeping that hip pressure in, right? So he gets this and he, he does his roll, right? He gets it or not, right? The guy rolls through. Here, when I'm coming up, if I if I don't put my hip pressure on, he's just going to he's gonna lip arm that through a lot of times. He's going to break it through, limp arm it the other way. So when I'm coming back up on top, boom, I've got my hips in and I'm driving him down. To his, down to his stomach, down to his chest, and I'm putting a lot of pressure on him. I'm driving forward with my toes. I've got my hips in here. Okay? <laughs> um, where you go from here, you want to go underneath the arm here and, and grab that wrist. All right, I'm going to pull that in. If I don't grab that wrist, he's just going to post out. I'm not going to be able to push him. I'm not going to be able to to run this bar. So I got to roll over top of this wrist. Okay, it's going to be hard to bring this in sometimes. So if I'm having trouble bringing this in, then I'm just going to do it as I'm driving. I get my hips off to one side here. And everything's nice and tight, all right? Everything's still tight. And I'm still putting pressure down with my hips, all right? I'm gonna start driving over this arm here, okay? I'm gonna start driving over that arm, all right? And I'm gonna get it underneath his chest, okay? Now from here, I'm gonna keep driving with my hips, but I also wanna sink back. I don't wanna get too high. See how high I am? All right, this is gonna be in trouble for me, okay? So I gotta sink back a little bit, here, all right? Keep it nice and tight, bring him right over top. <coughs> Right there. Okay, guys? That sink back, that's really important, all right? Okay, that's where a lot of people lose that move. Okay, that's where it, it gets too loose. This guy can wiggle out of it, all right? So, again, boom. I got this guy here, okay? I'm driving in here, okay? I'm driving in. I got a lot of hip pressure, all right? A lot of hip pressure. Now I gotta get a hold of that wrist. If I, I just need to get a hold of it, guys. I don't need to pull it in or anything, because I can do that as I'm driving, all right? So I start to drive it, bring that arm underneath, underneath his chest. All right, heavy hips, heavy hips, heavy hips. Sink back a little bit, all right? All right, keep walking, keep walking around. Now I can sit out, you know, do whatever I want to do. Okay, guys? So let's work from there. His move, right? His favorite move is tilt, okay? His, his tilt, he likes that tilt, right? Okay, I turn him, right? Okay, he starts to get off his back. I'm going from there, right? I'm sinking that in, right there. You let go of the wrist with this hand, okay? Boom, and then you drive up. Look at his hips. Okay? Look at the hips in. Right there, I got my hips in, my chest is up. Oh. Just like you talked about, okay? This makes it hard for him to get his base, it makes it hard for him to get his, his arm out, all right? Then work the rest of the bar, right? We drive over the wrist, keep the pressure, keep the pressure, keep the pressure. 
once I get them to here, sink back a little bit. Okay? Just keep it nice and tight. And you stack them up. Okay, guys? Think you can do that? <laughs> Let's do it. Ready? 